హాయ్ హలో నమస్తే వెల్కమ్ టు నవ్య విత్ మీ సౌజన్య మరి ఈ రోజు మనం హోలీ సెలబ్రేట్ చేసుకుంటాం కదా కాబట్టి అందరికీ కూడా హ్యాపీ హోలీ మరి ఈ హోలీ రోజున మనం డిజైనర్ వరుణ్ చక్లం గారి దగ్గరకు వచ్చేసామండి సో వారి ఇప్పటి వరకు చాలా సెలబ్రిటీస్కి డిజైనింగ్ అండ్ స్టైలింగ్ చేశారు అలాగే చాలా ఫ్యాషన్ వీక్స్ అండ్ షోస్ కూడా చేశారు మరి ఆయన ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ అండ్ జర్నీ ఎలా స్టార్ట్ అయింది ఏంటి అని ఆయన మాటలోనే డీటెయిల్స్ కుందాం హాయ్ వరుణ్ గారు హలో అండి ముందుగా మీకు హ్యాపీ హోలీ హాయ్ సేమ్ టు యూ థ్యాంక్ యూ అండ్ ఎవ్రీ ఇయర్ మీరు హోలీని ఎలా సెలబ్రేట్ చేసుకుంటారు హోలీ ఇస్ అ వెరీ స్పెషల్ ఫెస్టివల్ సిన్స్ ఇట్ సిగ్నిఫైస్ యు నో అలాట్ ఆఫ్ కలర్స్ అండ్ ఎవ్రీ కలర్ రిప్రజెంట్స్ ఇట్స్ ఓన్ క్వాలిటీస్ లైక్ ఇట్ సిగ్నిఫైస్ ఇస్ పీస్ హార్ యు నో హార్మోనీ అండ్ దెన్ అలాట్ ఆఫ్ గుడ్ స్టాఫ్ సో ఇట్స్ అ వెరీ స్పెషల్ ఫెస్టివల్ పర్టికులర్గా హోలీ రోజు నేను ఇలా చేయాలి ఇలా ఏమన్నా అని అని ఏమన్నా అనుకుంటారా మీరు బేకప్ అర్లీ ఇన్ ద మార్నింగ్ యూ నో వీ టేక్ అ షావర్ అండ్ దెన్ వీ హ్యావ్ అ బాన్ ఫైవ్ యూ నో సో వీ బిలీవ్ దట్ యూ నో ఆల్ ద నెగిటివ్ ఎనర్జీ ఇస్ గాన్ విత్ ఇట్ విత్ ద బాన్ ఫైవర్ అండ్ దెన్ ఇన్ ద ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ డిప్రెషన్ ఆర్ యాంగ్జైటీ సో ఇట్స్ వెరీ స్పెషల్ అగైన్ అండ్ దెన్ ఆఫ్టర్ దాట్ యూ నో వీ ఆల్ యూ నో వీ స్ప్రెడ్ colors and then we apply colors with each other with friends and family so that's how we celebrate uh, holi holi gurinchi maatladukunnam festival gurinchi alage mee profession gurinchi maatladukunte mere asal first designing eppudu start chesaru ela start chesaru i am from an engineering background okay. so i'm from a software background so i studied uh, computer sciences of, of engineering so i was always inclined towards fashion and arts okay. but i was not so sure probably at that time of uh, that period that i have to choose this line Okay. So once my friend uh, you know he asked me why don't you join to the theater arts work for costumes you were always inclined towards fashion so i joined in it and i started feeling this is something that i'm supposed to do okay. instead of you know sitting in front of a computer and then uh, you know doing the technical stuff so i thought i think i should pursue a career in creativity and fashion is all about being creative so that's all that's how the journey started Okay. after that you know i work for a store mm. for a year for an experience okay. then after my engineering i took up a course okay. in nift mm-hmm. so i did a diploma course and then i wanted some experience and then i uh, i worked with a store for a year and a half okay. and then i assisted in another designer who is very doing very good today okay. uh, in the international market so uh, you know that experience was needed mm. after that you know this is you can see me you know i just started up my brand and then it's doing good for now first time chesaru annaru kada theater ki so aa time lo meeku manchi compliments ela vachini mee aa experience ela undi i when i was working for the theater you know i had like no clue yeah. of what the fabrics are and all that is i've learned through my job that's when i used to touch the fabrics and realize that okay this is georgette yeah. this is chiffon okay. and these are the embroideries uh, that we play with and these are the colors that we are supposed to work with and all of it it was a nice experience so we styled around 150 uh, people who worked in the theater arts oh, so wow. they were all students they were all college students who wanted to pursue different careers like okay. in acting and uh, music drama and all of that so okay. it was a very nice experience because that's when you know you learn through your job also okay. not necessary that it education teaches you everything so that's where i learned my work and today this has become my profession so varun garu meer chapante color chaala pleasant ga english color lo undi so mari indo western style lo kuda undi at the same yeah. time so basically when you look at the whole garment it's a palazzo which is again very indo western yeah. so what we've done for this palazzo was we have added up a drape yeah so that's making the garment little from the western side yes and what we did was we give given her a bustier and then uh, the bustier is again teamed up with a nice jacket which is okay. embellished all the stones that you see here they're all swarovski stones okay they're all swarovski crystals so in a lot of my collections you know i use swarovski crystals okay you know like the real swarovski ones so the swarovski stone the shine is not like it's not too jet attack okay. it's not too shiny the limit of the shine is something very important okay. you so know I'm if it is too shiny also the garment looks 
the whole look of the garment changes. Yes, yes. And you can okay. see the bustier also. It's all studded with stones. Yes. And then we've added up a little, a tinge of pearls also. Yeah. So we mix up a lot of elements, you okay. know, to to come up with a new star, new uh, creative stuff. You know, we mix up a lot of elements and do it. When you see the jacket, the jacket took like nine karigas to okay. work for like at least three days. Mm. So it's it's all hand embroidery. Okay. So that's the reason you can see the intricateness in yes. the whole uh, outfit. Yeah. And you see the stones and the beads. And we've done a lot of mirror also because this yeah. season, you know, the mirror is in vogue. So we're playing with a lot of mirrors, a lot of sequins. Yes. And again, the English colors. Yes. Yeah. So basically this is a, an off shoulder top okay. and it's paired up with a ruffle uh, lehenga. Okay. It's a proper ruffle skirt. Okay. So you can see it's very voluminous yes. and the whole speciality about it is we've used a lot of fabric in it. Yes. Literally we've used uh, 50 meters of uh, the netted fabric, oh. uh, the tool fabric. And then okay. uh, it's sped up and then we've given a structure inside, you okay. know, which has got like a can-can layering and all of that. So okay. that makes this whole uh, garment very unique and uh, very okay. different. And you can see the ruffles also. Yes. So this season, you know, according to the f uh, fashion forecast, you know, we're playing with a lot of ruffles, a lot of mirrors, yeah. you know, that I've mentioned earlier. Yes. And it's coming to the top, you can yeah. see it's a very uh, intricate embroidery yes. that has been done on the top. And it's an off-shoulder top. Yes. You know, you can either wear it like on one sleeve, you can do it with a cup with like two sleeves, yes. you know, and then there's an inner boost here again. So it's very different. And you can see a lot of rose motifs also. Yes. Because uh, that is something that signifies the collection. Okay. It's all about the roses, the corals, mm. and the colors again, the dainty uh, light pastel colors. Uh, so this particular top, you know, you can you can do it for your sangeet. You know, okay. someone can wear it for a cocktail. Okay. You know, the whole collection is also, it's all about the cocktail collection. I think a bride can definitely wear for her sangeet or yes. probably for a cocktail or an evening dinner, yes. you know. And it gives a very princessy feel to the whole garment, yes. the whole look of it. We can do it in darker colors, we can do it in lighter pastel colors. Okay. You can do it in a mono color also, like one color. Yeah. Or you can pair it up with another color. Like here we've done like a pastel blue yes. and then a nice blush pink yes. on the bottom. So it can either be a single color or a mono color. Again, coming to the crystals, you know, you, you see a light tiny crystals yes. all over which is beaded. Yeah. Again, mirrors and yes. some Swarovski stones added up. So, you know, in the night events, you know, it'll be a very glossy and it'll give you a very uh, nice dainty look yes. to the whole garment. So you can see there's a lot of cut work yes. happening on the edging of the whole top. You can see there's a cut work happening on the top of it, yes. like yes. towards the neckline and we're doing a cut work on the hemline also. Yes. So that gives a very different, unique feel to the whole garment. Okay. So, you know, instead of having a regular neckline, we want to do a different neckline with little cut work, edging. Yeah. You know, it looks so very I'm organic. So okay. every collection we had inspired with something new. Yeah. You know, one collection was uh, more about drapes, about structured outfits. This collection, you know, we've taken roses as our inspiration okay. uh, and we've done a lot of rose motifs with, again, with the ruffles yeah. and all, you know, uh, with a lot of voluminous outfits. So in India, we have two seasons, basically a spring, summer and then winter festive. So seeing them, you know, winter festive, ki we do a lot of uh, darker colors, like all those bright colors and darker colors. And uh, summer, ki we do a lot of pastel colors, which are very fresh yeah. to see and uh, look at. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Industry, Chalaman celebrities, designing chaser, styling chaser. So, first time just an experience allowing the Pudavar and the Manik chaser. So, we've done for a lot of actresses yeah. and actors. Mm. Like, uh, one of my favorites is working with Vijay Devarkunda. I think today he's a <laughs> sensation. Yes. Uh, why? Because, you know, I think he's got such a persona that yeah. he can carry anything yes. on him, uh, make it a different look, yeah. you see. He, he can carry a very edgy garment to a very modern silhouette. 
so anything fits him so well and he, the, his persona you know resembles all of that yes so that's something i really enjoy working with him so we've okay. done a shoot for the forbes magazine okay. that he was part of mm. and uh, there was a signature event that uh, we we styled him up for so i think a couple of events we've done with vijay devarkonda okay, so and a couple of songs ki kuda chesamu ravi teja gari ki and then uh, that was for uh, neela ticket movie meer ekkuga designing a type of designs ni ekkuga cheyali etuvandi colors ni meer like chestaru i like to play with a lot of pastel colors you can okay. see my whole yeah. studio it's filled with pastel colors yes. i somehow like the whole um, uh, sensitivity of the pastel colors and even when we do we play with a lot of english colors Okay. because i feel uh, y- the when you are yes. wearing also you look, you look so pretty in it with, yeah. it's also yes. a pastel color yeah. so we like to play with a lot of pastel colors and a very english colors and coming to garments and silhouettes you know we do a lot of different cuts mm. uh, suppose this season you know we're doing a lot of uh, peplums which are very trendy okay. for the season and then uh, we're doing a lot of palazzos adding okay. up a drape to the palazzo giving okay. it a very indian look yeah. you know giving it a sari feel to the garment Okay. You know, we're we're working with a lot of new silhouettes like that. Okay. You see this gown; uh, it's all with a very intricate work. Okay. And it's all uh, again the color is very English. Yes. So that's where the modernity adds in it. Yeah. Because we dress up; we like to dress up a new age bride. Yes. Who wants to be very modern, but sticking to her roots. Yes. That come from the India. Yeah. So that's how it is. Yeah. సో వరణ్ గారు ఇప్పుడు వరకు మాకు ఇండో వెస్ట్రన్ స్టైల్ చూపించారు కాక్టైల్ పార్టీస్కి రిలేటెడ్లో చాలా చూపించారు కదా మరి ఇప్పుడు మాకు ట్రెడిషనల్ కలెక్షన్ ఉన్నటువంటి లెహంగాని మరి దీని గురించి మాకు ఎలా చెప్తారు ఎటువంటి ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ చేస్తారు సో ఇది వచ్చేసి చాలా కొత్త కలర్ అండి ఇట్స్ ఎ టీల్ కలర్ జనరల్గా మనం వీసీ అ లాట్ ఆఫ్ ఎలక్ట్రిక్ బ్లూ లేకపోతే వైలెటిష్ బ్లూ అండ్ దెన్ యూ హ్యావ్ అ నేవీ బ్లూ Yeah. and probably a midnight blue yeah. so but this color is little different it's yes. very unique color yeah. it's, it's a, a teal color colors. yeah it's a teal color so it's a very bright color again you know coming to our aesthetics yes. we've teamed it up with a nice pastel color yeah. and the whole thing you know apro you, you see a lot of uh, zardozi and all everywhere yeah. can to make it a little different we've used a lot of sequins okay. our sequins kuda it's all matte finish sequins yes. so when you see a matte finish sequins make a cheap look kunda you know it will give you a very nice dainty look Okay. to the whole garment so uh, again you know it's all uh, embellished with lot of creepers of yes. sequins and giving a very coral touch to the whole uh, garment yeah. and then you've got some nice we've mixed up two three different colors of sequins also yes. you can see a nice white yeah. in it a pearl white yes. and then there is uh, a light aqua color also yes. so and we've mixed up with little of glass beads mm. so coming to all of this when we've mixed up it becomes a combination yes. and then you can see it's it's beautifully done yeah. you know it's, it's got a lot of uh, creepers beautiful. yeah and uh, to make it a little different you know you see a lot of lehengas will just have borders yeah. either like but a small tiny motifs coming yeah. which will give a very routine look yes. to make it a little different we started we made it very heavy on the yeah. top and coming to the bottom it's very scattered so you know you can uh, someone can drape this uh, lehenga in this way or they can leave the dupatta on one side okay. you know they can wear it like a crop top and a skirt also yes. giving it a different whole new feel to the garment yes. and coming to the blouse again we've keep, kept it a little more subtle yeah. we've used again a pastel color yes. which is the aqua you know aqua it's a bluish green yes. in color and then it's embellished with silver beads and then little of swarovskis and sequins and all of it so it's a nice uh, deep neckline mm. and then again cutwork is something that uh, is very trendy now for yes, the season yeah. so we've used a lot of cutwork to the whole garment the blouse has got little cutwork yes. and when you notice the dupatta also it's got again cutwork and yes. uh, it's all beaded so ilandi garment you can wear it for a sangeet again yeah. and you know wedding time receptions or stay yes. you oh. can wear it for a nice reception your reception or someone's like for example a bridesmaid can also wear it yes you know uh, for a nice event
మరి ఇప్పటి వరకు మీరు చాలా ఫ్యాషన్ వీక్స్ చేశారు ఫ్యాషన్ షోస్ కూడా చేశారు ఆ ఎక్స్‌పీరియన్స్ ఫస్ట్ టైం చేసినప్పుడు ఎలా అనిపించింది హే దిస్ మేకప్ దేర్ సో మెనీ లుక్స్ పుట్ టుగెదర్ అండ్ ఇట్స్ వెరీ కియోటిక్ బట్ వి ఎంజాయ్ డూయింగ్ ఇట్ ఓకే డెఫినెట్లీ బికాజ్ దట్స్ వేర్ వి గెట్ అ లాట్ ఆఫ్ ఎక్స్‌పోజర్ వి గెట్ టు రిలీజ్ అ న్యూ కలెక్షన్ యు నో న్యూ యు నో వి వాట్ ఎవర్ సిల్వెట్స్ దట్ వి డు అండ్ యు నో ద న్యూ స్టైల్స్ దట్ వి కమ్ అప్ విత్ సో ఫ్యాషన్ వీక్ ఇస్ డెఫినెట్లీ లైక్ Uh, in every designer's dream okay. to exhibit their own collection yes, yes. yeah alage ippudu varaku the best compliment me kanipinchindi meeku thought lo unnadu emanna unda so i've got a, i've received a lot of compliments last year we've done a show at the falaknama palace okay. so vijay devakunda again you know he was the show stopper okay. so we did a very edgy outfit for him we did a drape for him and with a nice structured blazer okay. which is a long jacket mm-hmm. and it's inspired by these uh, western uh, trench coats okay you know we did a very different look you know till uh, till today you know we received a lot of compliments for it you know we get uh, from different actors have called me and they were like this look is amazing dude it's really nice you know that okay. gives us that boosts us a lot yes, yes. family ni support ela unda uh, my parents always supported me first of all ka ardham kali like what is this guy because i studied engineering yes. and i am doing something totally different yes. so they were like they were very scared but they were always like you study and do whatever you want you know that is something my parents have already always uh told me they've encouraged me my mom and my dad have been like a strength of pillars okay and they've always supported me my entire family my friends you know they've pushed me a lot that's the reason i think because of them i'm here today సో వరుణ్ గారు మీ కలెక్షన్ దేని దానికి చాలా చాలా అంటే చాలా బ్యూటిఫుల్గా ఉంది సో మరి ఈ లాంగ్ ఫ్రాక్ గురించి ఎలా ఏం చెప్తారు అసలు సో అగైన్ దిస్ ఈస్ అ ఫ్లో లెంత్ గౌన్ అండ్ దెన్ ఇట్స్ ఆల్ మేడ్ అండ్ ఒగాన్జా ద ఫ్యాబ్రిక్ ద కాంపోజిషన్ ఇస్ ఆల్సో వెరీ హై సో వీ జనరలీ యూజ్ లైక్ అరౌండ్ వన్ ఫిఫ్టీ గ్రామ్స్ ఆఫ్ ఒగాన్జా సో దట్స్ లైక్ వన్ ఆఫ్ ద థికెస్ట్ ఒగాన్జాస్ ద రీజన్ వీ యూజ్ ద దిస్ హై క్వాలిటీ ఒగాన్జా ఇస్ ఇట్స్ గాట్ అ లాట్ ఆఫ్ వర్క్ జనరలీ ఇఫ్ యూ డోంట్ యూజ్ దిస్ heavy grammage of organza the the fabric puckers and okay. you can see all those folds and all of it so we use a very heavy organza and okay. coming to the color it's a sage green okay. very fresh again for the season and then on the sage green we've done some floral uh, motifs yes. with some abstract art okay. you know you can see all these lines and the geometric yes. uh, embroidery yeah. and that has been beaded with some self on self work Okay. like you can see the you can see the self green sage color beads yeah. and then silver color beads also on yes. it the colors that we are working on especially are sage green okay. uh, we are doing a lot of blush pink and then uh, clear water that is also one amazing color yeah. and then aqua color okay uh, we are doing a lot of uh, lavender you know which is very in for the season the more of color we okay. use a lot of organza we use, we play with a lot of tulle fabric okay. the netted fabric uh, raw silk you know to support the hand loom uh, thing we use a lot of uh, raw silks we use silk the pattu silk you know we use that also and chiffon especially and then a lot of uh, georgets okay. you know these are the fabrics that we generally play with మరి మీ కలెక్షన్ లో మరి ఈ డ్రెస్ గురించి మాకు ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ చేస్తారా ఇప్పటి వరకు మీరు చాలా పేస్టల్ కలర్స్ చూసారు నా వి ఆర్ మూవింగ్ టువర్డ్స్ ద డార్కర్ కలర్స్ ద బ్రైటర్ కలర్స్ సో కమింగ్ టు దిస్ అవుట్ ఫిట్ యు నో ఇట్స్ అ నైస్ క్రిమ్సన్ రెడ్ అండ్ దట్ ఆన్ ద క్రిమ్సన్ రెడ్ రెడ్ వీవ్ డన్ అ లాట్ ఆఫ్ ఫ్లోరల్ వర్క్ యూ కెన్ సీ ఇట్స్ ఆల్ అ ఫ్లోరల్ బంచెస్ అండ్ ఇట్స్ గాట్ సమ్ నైస్ పేస్టల్ కలర్స్ ఆన్ ఇట్ అండ్ దెన్ ఇట్స్ హైలైటెడ్ విత్ సమ్ నైస్ క్రిస్టల్స్ అండ్ దెన్ ద గ్లాస్ బీడ్స్ ఆన్ ఇట్ అండ్ కమింగ్ టు ద టాప్ ఇట్స్ అ కాసెటెడ్ టాప్ you know it's a very again a very western influence top yes. corset uh, is something that have been uh, in the fashion history for our longest times so that is where we've taken the inspiration from okay. it's all very embellished with uh, a lot of floral thread work yeah. you can see it's all uh, it's all the chicken work you know that's all the proper thread work yeah. that's been done and to highlight it we've used a bit of swarovski stones here and there yes. a very little of them yeah. and then we've used a glass beads also on it 
द होल कलेक्शन इज ऑल वेरी कॉकटेलिश मन विप्रोवर को चूस इन वन मी सो दिस कैन बी प्रॉपरली वो प्रॉपरली अ मेहंदी इवेंट की बिकॉज इट्स अ ब्राइट अ कलर एंड अगेन संगीत की यू नो लॉट ऑफ ब्राइड्स कैन डू दैम Okay. You know, this can be. You know, you can team it up with a nice dupatta also, in case someone would want to carry a dupatta. You know, to make it look a little more grand and a little more dressier, you okay. can team it up with a nice dupatta also. Probably red in color, or yeah. we may have different colors on it also. Like yeah. we have a light uh, pastel pink, pink, and then you've got a nice uh, sea green on it. Yeah. So we can team it up with either of uh, those dupattas okay. to make it look a little more grander, yes. and probably we can embellish those dupattas also. ఎవరికైనా నేను ఈ పర్టికులర్ యాక్ట్రెస్ ఆర్ యాక్టర్ కి నేను చేయాలి డిజైనింగ్ చేయాలి ఆర్ స్టైలింగ్ చేయాలని అన్న ఎప్పుడైనా అనిపిస్తుంది ఐ థింక్ ఐ కన్సిడర్ దీపిక పడుకోన్ టు బి అ దీవా ఓకే సో యు నో వన్స్ ఇన్ అ టైం ప్రాబ్లీ ఇఫ్ ఐ గెట్ an opportunity definitely i would want to work definitely with her. i think you got yeah. that opportunity yeah. will soon thank you so yeah. much వరుణ్ గారు థ్యాంక్ యూ సో మచ్ మీ ఇంత బిజీ టైంలో కూడా మా కోసం మీ జర్నీ గురించి అలాగే మీ ఎక్స్పీరియన్స్ చాలా మాతో షేర్ చేసుకున్నారు థ్యాంక్ యూ సో మచ్ అండ్ వన్స్ అగైన్ హ్యాపీ హోలీ సేమ్ టు హ్యాపీ హోలీ ఫర్ ఆల్ యువర్ వ్యూవర్స్ థ్యాంక్ యూ సో మచ్ థ్యాంక్ యూ ఈ కార్యక్రమాన్ని www.youtube.com/vanitatv channel లో చూడండి